so I get here um, in the uh, August of 1980. One of my best friends said to me, remember the name Glenn Doc Rivers. Glenn um, was uh, a freshman with me and countless others in Marquette's McCormick Hall. And I remember Mark Murata was a freshman at that time. Uh, they never uh, would present themselves as more important than us. You, know, you could easily sit and have lunch with Mark um, in, the, in Schrader Hall. You can engage with Glenn in a way that was, um, you know, easy going, friendly, um, equals. So we're playing in the rec center, it's five on five pickup basketball. And um, Glenn is on the opposite team. And I make a steal. I have an uncontested route to the basket. I go up, shoot the ball, believing it's gonna be a layup. I come down and I look and everybody sitting on the sideline is looking that way. And I look that way and I see the ball is still in the air going on to the other court. It dawns on me that Glenn had caught up to me, blocked the shot in such a demonstrative way that maybe it was quite uncalled for. But um, as a, you know, I enjoyed the moment. Uh, and, uh, you know, if you're going to have your shot blocked so demonstrably and be humiliated, um, having it by um, Glenn Rivers at that time uh, felt kind of good. I was on the same court with him.